This is the King of Trainers telling you to subscribe to Crep Junkie TV. Press the button. For me personally, like this this new kind of sneaker scene. Like the reason why I say new sneaker scene is because it's like a, I, f I think it's like a, a post old, old sneaker scene where it's like, you know, a lot of people kind of jumping into the scene, etc., which is a good thing. I like that. But I definitely believe that there shouldn't be segregation. I, I think there's a lot of segregation. There's a lot of things happening where someone's trying to do a certain thing and then they're getting blocked for no reason. And I don't get it. I don't understand that, you know. So for me, like anyone who's segregating other people, they should stop. That's that's a no-no. Um, I definitely think that the egos as well, like like it's fun. It's sneakers. Don't take it. Like, it's only trainers. It's glue and plastic and rubber, and it's only sneakers. It's not that deep, you know. Sometimes I might post stuff up, and I think I said this before on like my channel. It's just that people get so upset if I I make something say a wrong thing, or or even if I don't shout them out i'm like yo it's that like, chill it's, it's only like sneakers like you know I, I definitely feel that like people have taken this thing way too seriously you know that's why i try to bring light that's why i don't know if you see on my my instagram king of trainers at king of trainers <laughs> on my instagram um i always crack joke i'm like cracking joke and and like trying to put memes up and that sort of stuff and even doing memes of myself you know where i'm just taking the you know the, the biscuit out of myself so I, I really definitely feel that we it's a it's an industry isn't it so at the end of the day i understand people are serious but you know only like i mean i make money out of social media that's my thing it doesn't make sense so a lot of people who they're not making money do you get what i mean so they they shouldn't take it as seriously as like they're getting paid or and all that sort of stuff i mean i do get get money but at the end of the day like it's they take it to way too serious like you know if you post something wrong or you don't tag a certain picture or you don't do this and this they're like oh my god why don't you use my picture i'm like yo chill man it's like it's instagram it's pictures like you know and that's why i'm happy they put edit button because <laughs> i always make a lot of mistakes but yeah no nah, but yeah definitely a few things i mean there's that and just people blocking other people man let, let, let people eat do you get what i mean let people live let people progress you know what we have to understand is the UK sneaker scene is small, tiny, compared to the international sneaker scene or even European sneaker scene. And um, let's look at London alone. There's nine million people in London, and a few people are trying to move forward. And people are kind of saying, "No, you can't. You can't." Like, no, nah, come on, man. Do you know what I'm saying? There's like what 65 million people in the United Kingdom. So let's let's be like, let's be real with the numbers, you know. And if we look at the actual um, scale of sneaker sales quote unquote the sneakers don't even make up i think a, a massive percentage of sneaker sales so when we go to, into this whole sneaker head sneaker head thing we've got to look at the overall grand scale if we're making if someone's in a position and they're making mad money then that's cool then you know you have something to fight for but if you're not doing those numbers like don't try to block other people from from trying to eat so that's that's kind of my, my two cents on, on, on things there the front of my car just completely mashed up. The door burst open. I kind of hit my head on the steering wheel. When I came around, I looked down at my feet and there was one of my trainers missing. I don't know how, but literally in the impact, it, the shoe had blown off my foot. The ambulance came, the police came. We need to take you to hospital, we need to do this. No, you don't understand. I need to find my trainer. <laughs>